Hello everyone! Asparagus is in the season, so let's use it for something. Today I'm gonna show you easy final recipe with green asparagus, poached egg, hollandaise sauce foam, mushrooms, goat cheese and prosciutto. So let's not waste time and get started. And let's start with hollandaise sauce foam. I need egg yolks, white wine, butter, lemon and salt. For my sauce I'm gonna need clarified butter, so I'm gonna use the technique with microwave. So I cook it on medium power until the butter will be completely melted and then I leave it on the table to separate. And in the meantime I can start with my hollandaise sauce. So I mix egg yolks with white wine inside the bowl, season it with salt and I'm gonna cook it slowly on bain-marie until I get thick mix. And don't forget to keep whisking with the whisk for all time so you don't get any lumps inside. When the eggs are thicker, I can take it out from the heat and I mix the butter slowly in. But first I have to clarify it. So I take out the white part from the top. And then I separate the fat. On the bottom is the milk part which you don't want to mix in. And you end up with clear clarified butter. And now you can slowly whisk it inside the egg mix. I just season it with fresh lemon juice and the hollandaise sauce is ready. And to make it foam, I just move it inside a siphon bottle, put one charge of gas, mix it properly and the hollandaise sauce foam is ready. Let's do just a quick test. I think it's looking amazing. So I keep it in the hot water so it stays hot and let's finish the rest. And the next thing I need for my recipe is one poached egg, so let's do it. So I crack the egg inside a small bowl. Then I prepare my boiling water with a little bit of vinegar inside. I make a vortex and then I can put my eggs slowly in. And I'm gonna cook it around two and a half minutes, so the egg white is set and the egg yolk is nice and runny. So the egg is cooking and in the meantime I can roast my almonds. So I just spread almond flakes on the baking tray and I'm gonna bake it inside the oven around 180 degrees Celsius until I get nice color on them. Poached egg is cooked enough so I just transfer it inside the warm water so it stays hot and it will be ready for the plating. Also take out the almonds from the oven and leave them to cool down on the table. And now I can start with asparagus. So I'm gonna peel it and then I'm gonna cook it in boiling water. But the first thing you wanna do with every green asparagus is the crack test. So I just put pressure on the bottom of the asparagus and I leave it to crack it naturally. The bottom part you can use for any soup or velouté but it's not really nice to eat. Then I can take it out, the small leaves. And the last step is to peel it nicely. So the asparagus is ready and the last thing I have to prepare are mushrooms and then I'm gonna finish all together. I have here these beautiful oyster mushrooms, so I just separate them with the hands and let's cook it. I start with a little bit of vegetable oil inside the pan and on very high heat I cook the mushrooms. At this time you can season it with salt and pepper or even different spices.
and at the same time I gonna cook my asparagus in salted boiling water for around 2 minutes. Mushrooms gets nice color so I can put my prosciutto in. I gonna keep cooking for around 1 more minute and it will be ready for the plating. At this time it's asparagus also ready so I just season it with salt pepper and a little bit of vegetable oil and let's do the plating. I start with beautifully cooked green asparagus on the bottom. Then is coming my poached egg on the top. Few spoons of mushrooms with prosciutto. I also put a little bit of goat cheese. And now is final time for my Hollandaise sauce form. I sprinkle it with my roasted almonds. And finish it with nasturtium and radish leaves. So what do you think guys? Do you like it? Let me know in the comments. And if you are passionate amateur cook who would like to learn the basics of finally cooking properly, so then you can create your own dishes and play them at home like a professional chef, check out the link in the description down below and apply for my one-on-one -on -one mentoring and I will personally help you. That's everything for today. Thank you for watching and I see you soon.